Keep your weapon sheathed, newcomer. Good thing you sailed in with Captain Kaleen. Outsiders aren't welcome on Betnik, especially not now. Bloodthorn cultists attack the fortress. You're lucky you don't look like them or you'd have a spear in your belly. Of course, we slaughtered most, the rest fled. We stole something from the chief, but we'll get it back. We'll mop them up as soon as Chief Tazgal raises the army. You want to know more? Ask Lambour. Curse Jakan. How does he slip about so easily? I turn my back for one moment and he's gone. He's probably off of those slatterns from Stros Mackay. If I find any of them, it won't be pretty. Staying out of trouble? This was part of a larger plan, I'm sure of it. The Bloodthorn cult assaulted the fortress. They were repulsed, but they stole a Breton scroll the orcs found here long ago. Chief Tazgul thinks the attack failed, but I'm not so sure. The cultists retreated after the initial assault. They came here to steal that scroll, I'm sure of it. But why? Have they set a trap for us? We must know before the Chief decides to attack. Start with Shaman Laganak. She witnessed Bloodthorn rituals in the Carved Hills. She's waiting by the Longhouse south of here. Cultists were also seen at Moriselli to the north, and Grimfield west of here. It's an alien ruin. Years ago, Breton raiders attacked us. An outnumbered patrol held there for weeks until they were wiped out. Later, our army destroyed the raiders. It's just a ruin, really. I don't know what the Bloodthorn want with it. It's a graveyard. Not ours. Breton. When we conquered the islands hundreds of years ago, War Chief Isgul left it intact out of respect for our enemies. We don't desecrate graves, but the Bloodthorn cult will. Plenty of fresh bodies. It's mostly wilderness. There are alien ruins, but they were looted long ago. I don't know what the Bloodthorns want there, but Lagonic might know more. I trust you are here to help. Dark rituals are being performed around the island. I first smelled the corruption on the wind. Then my shaman found evidence at an alien ruin nearby. The same cult that attacked the fortress. I sense a link between the attack and the rituals. There is a way to be certain. Chief Tazgol has forbidden me from pursuing this, so I ask you to. By the bridge to the south is a totem. Those who touch it see visions. It may show you a vision that links the attack to the rituals I feel corrupting the island. Follow wherever the vision leads you. You journey into danger. Choose your steps carefully. The land remembers those who tread upon it, for good or ill. The totem taps into these memories and shows us the ghosts of the past. Watch those weapons. You have the scroll. Rejoice that you did not fail. Varden will be pleased. I live to serve my masters. Go west to the Aeliad site. The scroll's ritual should enable you to succeed where the others fail. I will not fail you, mistress. Now, read the scroll. The ritual it holds will send you into the spirit realm. Should you succeed, I will follow. 
In the name of the Bloodthorns, enter the Spirit Realm. Failure again. Perhaps an ancient curse lingers here. I will try the ritual in our lair. Well, look who's here. I've got your back, good looking. Looking for you? Lagonic told me you were headed this way, chasing the creeps who attacked the fortress. Sure, I tracked a few of them to their cave. Rather than poke around on my own, I decided to wait for you, my friend. And here you are. Grave. Great memories. I'm gonna rob this place clean. Later. Ask them to leave the island. Enter the spirit realm. The next phase of our mission can begin. Your return? What did you learn of the Bloodthorn plans? The fools! Did they succeed? The dangers that face us become clearer. I will try to convince Chief Tazgol of this, though I doubt he will accept the word of an outsider. Your efforts on our behalf bring you honor. Stop right there. No one enters. Chief Tasgul's orders. Bloodthorn cult. They're raising zombies all over the graveyard. I'm here to keep the people out until War Chief Tasgul arrives and crushes them all. Ha! An army? These are Breton zombies. Flimsy little bodies in the ground. They'll die easy. Still, if you feel like slaughtering cultists, I won't stop you. Start with the crypt in the center. I saw a few in there. You get into trouble, you're on your own. This was a Breton island, hundreds of years ago. War Chief Isgul and the Seamount Orcs wiped them out. The Seamounts were the fiercest raiders on the sea, until we settled here. Steel and stone, how could you ask? High, defensible cliffs, a view of all approaches from the fortress, fertile land for crops. What's not to like? Isgul's wives insisted we settle here, so we did. My orders are to watch them until they try to break out, or until Chief Tazgul gets here and cuts off their heads, that's all. An orc follows orders, even if they're stupid. We're not savages. We respect the enemy's dead. When an orc dies, he gets a cairn to mark where he fell, weapons atop it. We don't stick our dead in the ground like Bretons. Even so, we won't desecrate their graves.
Greetings, stranger. You are not a cultist. Help us defeat these necromancers. Take the Staff of Arche, a potent weapon against undead. You must first charge the staff, then use it to destroy the foul abominations summoned by these necromancers. The blasphemers employ dark magic to raise the dead, disrupt their rituals, and release that energy. The staff of Arche will convert this into power to destroy their dark creations. In life, I was a priestess of Arche. I served King Renwick for many years. I was with him when the Seamount Orcs invaded. We died together at their hands. Many died under their blades, but that was long ago. The Bloodthorn cultists desecrate our graves today. I beg you to stop them. Even in death, I watch over my people. Necromancy is a crime against Arche. The aura of corruption builds as my countrymen's bodies are raised and desecrated by these minions of the worm. I need your help to stop them. The Bloodthorn cult's necromancy corrupts nature. They're led by reachmen of the worst sort, allies of Manamarco. They raise our dead to assault the orcs. This desecration must end! Well now, what have we here? Out for a stroll? Enjoying the scenery? Just exploring the island? I came across these fine fellows disturbing the graves and decided to kill a few. I've collected some robes in this bag. Take one if you want the zombies to leave you alone. I'll be hunting cultists while you're playing with your staff. If I find any more robes, I'll leave them for you. These necromancers are disgusting, but they do dress well. charged. Quickly, meet me at my tomb. I sense great power in the staff. You've done well. The staff will reveal circles of corruption among the crypts. There lurk the Bloodthorn cult's abominations, hidden in pockets of oblivion. Plant the staff in a circle to draw an abomination into our world, then destroy it! End of the graveyard. The Bloodthorn's perversion of my people is ended. The honored dead are at rest once again. The cult focused all their power into their abominations. Now these are dust and ash. The threat to us is ended, but the threat to you remains. King Redmwick wishes to repay our debt to you. Speak to him. Learn your true peril. You have returned my people to their rest. I wish to repay you, but I have only information to give. The Seamount Orcs attacked generations ago. They took our island. Under their rule, what we called Betany became Betnik. My failure to defend my people was unforgivable. But how I attempted to defeat the Orcs was worse. I attempted necromancy. An ancient alien relic is buried on this island. The Bloodthorns seek its power. Enter the portal beside me. You'll see my last day through the eyes of my enemies. Learn what you can. Targoth! The Breton King has sealed himself deeper in the ruin. He is preparing some foul spell. I know only that the magic he summons will slaughter our army. Unless we stop him, every orc here will die. We must learn how to reach their cowardly king and the nature of his foul magic. Make these prisoners talk. We have confiscated their belongings. They may hold clues to what they know. 
The code of Malak is clear. So long as these Bretons aid their king and his foul magic, they remain our enemies. If you can coerce them through words alone, do so. If not, they must pay the blood price. I took this charm off a Reach Witch. Hold it tight and order any guard to execute his prisoner. The charm will chain their soul and compel them to answer you. You will have one question, Targoth. Ask wisely. They aid their king in his foul plan to kill us all. Unless they tell us how to stop him, his magic will wipe us out. We are at war, Targoth. Do what you must. Don't steal. Don't attack without reason. Fight with honor. Protect your tribe. These Bretons claim to have surrendered, but if they refuse to answer truthfully, they remain our mortal enemies. You. How much more blood do you want? You've invaded my home. You've slaughtered my people. Why would I help you, Orc? You'll kill us all anyway. Vizan? No, she's just a child. You cannot kill our child. No, oh, Renwick, forgive me. There are crystals and braziers by the door. Turn them to lower the wards. Now please, spare our daughter. Bandit. Butcher. I am not afraid of you. I know nothing about his plans. I thought orcs had honor. Now you threaten unarmed prisoners? We have surrendered. Ransom us like civilized folk. Savage orc. Do what you will. I will not betray my king or the royal family. When the mainland hears of what you've done, they will crush you. Stay your blade, orc. The fight is over. Orc, you will pay for this. Ha! You dictate terms, pig child? Give me back my sword and I'll give you a clean end. Ask your questions. Amuse me. He told me to die valiantly and take as many of you with me as I could. See the bodies stacked around us? I've done my duty. My king is beyond your reach. We are done talking. I fear the worst. Whatever shall I do? Spare your blade, Orc. We have yielded to you. Why threaten me? Our island is yours now. Spare us, spare our king, and let me lead the survivors into exile. You have my word as a priest of Arche. Then hear me. Arche compels me to break my silence. King Renwick is desperate. He seeks an ancient power hidden in the ruins. Scrolls as old as the island whisper of a terrible weapon, an alien relic. It summons an undead army, one I fear he cannot control. That army is a crime against Arche, and it will slaughter more than orcs. I love my king, but you must stop him. Gargoth! Our victory is near! By Moloch's right hand, my war caller triumphs again. We will end this assault and the efforts of this cowardly king. There's no honor in the slaughter of a broken people and defeated knights. If King Renwick surrenders, he will join his people in exile. Let them spread word of our ferocity across the seas. Then I will cut him down. Stay your blade beyond this door, Targoth. Leave King Renwick to me. Aliens! Damn you, help me! What's this? Yeah. 
Yes, I feel your power. But how do you work? Renwick, surrender now, and I'll spare your worthless life. Stay back! I hold destruction in my hands. Magic cannot save you. Surrender or die! Leave now, or I'll use this relic to obliterate you! You will not harm my people! Draw steel! Help me! Help me, damn you all! Targoth, bury this elf-loving fool. Those who remain will accept exile or die. Even my death failed my people. Yes. Once I summoned the relic's power, I realized what it demanded of me. Souls. It craves souls. I would not pay that price, but the Bloodthorn will. They will raise this undead army and slaughter you all. The Aeliad Relic is the key, but my memories have faded with time. I no longer remember its location. I know only that you must find it before the Bloodthorn. I offer this knowledge as payment for the souls you saved today. Our war was a long time ago. Once we've cleared out the cult, we'll rebury any bodies they've defiled. Even Breton dead deserve that dignity. Also, I don't want them creeping into town at night. Be at peace, ancestors. What curse disturbs your rest? The souls of the dead are restless. Ancient warriors who died in battle against the Bretons now rise. Who calls to them, and why? You are one of the newcomers. Another of your group, the mage Naramo, went to see what he could uncover. Find him and learn what he has seen. His magic enabled him to pass the spirits undetected. I suspect he looks to reach the inner ruins. Seek him near the doorway, beyond the fields where the dead roam. Be careful. Foul magic taints the air. Perhaps your learned friend can shed some light on this dark mystery and help you to bring an end to its source. The Aeliads, wild elves as some call them, have always fascinated me. They are long gone, but their ruins remain on Betnik. From these we glean how they lived and died so many years ago. We are not all warriors. And we are far from the savages outsiders assume. Some of us wield a quill as skillfully as others wield war hammers. Ah, my old friend. Couldn't resist another exploration? Be mindful. This one may be a touch more dangerous. Foul necromancy is at work here. The mysteries of Nern span beyond the Dwemer. The Aeliads fascinate me in equal measure. I had to see this place for myself. The more vexing mystery at present, however, lies with these Orc spirits. Even you must have noticed the ghostly figures in the field. This is no ordinary haunting. Something brought them back and binds them here. I suspect the answer is inside the catacombs. Indeed you should. The ruin is sealed magically, but it is a minor challenge. I shall unseal the door for you and await your return. My research is best done in safety. Just like old times, isn't it? I do like to have such a useful tool, uh, ally with me. A proper application of magic to these stones, and the way is open. You proved yourself capable in Bethsark. I trust you can handle whatever this ruin holds. I will remain at a safe distance. You... You are not one of them. You have not the taint. Help us. Free us from this torment. 
I am Targoth, war caller of the Stone Wolves. Cultists have violated my tomb, and those of my warriors. The vile priestess Drusilla leads the cult, dragging our spirits back to this realm. In life, I wielded a magical warhorn. My soldiers obeyed it, hearing its call across all barriers. Drusilla now uses it to call my warriors from beyond the grave, binding them to her will. She is in the lower chambers. Kill her before she can send my soldiers against our descendants. That will free me from her bonds. Then the horn can return my warband to its honored rest. Freed me, but my warriors still cry out for an end to their torment. I overheard them mention the ruin of Karzog's demise. Whatever they're planning, it is to take place there. But that is not my concern. Now that you have the horn, free my warriors. Return the horn to its rightful place atop my tomb in the next chamber. Then my warriors will rest once again. Then you condemn my warriors to further degradation. Surely you have more honor than that. We no longer belong in this realm. Our battle is over. Let us have peace. Your efforts honor us, champion. I feel the spirits of my warriors return to rest, and so I shall follow. Be bold, warrior. The cultists still plague this island. You will meet them again, to their sorrow. Nothing but dusty tomes and rusty weapons. I expected tagging along with Naramo to be more lucrative. Superbly done, as expected. I'll just take a look around now that you've cleared the way. Foul cultists defiling the souls of the dead. I hope we find more of them so I can cut down a few myself. No one said anything about haunted ruins and necromancers. I didn't sign up for this. The spirits have vanished. Their valiant souls rest once again. Quickly, tell me what you found below. We have much to discuss. Cults have indeed been spotted at Karzok's demise. Intent is unknown. I will pray for the honored dead, then return to speak with the chief. I fear all will be needed to end the Bloodthorn plot. <laughs> Found you. We need you back at the fortress, right now. Orc scouts sighted Bloodthorn cultists and Karzog's demise. Tosgol's mobilizing the army to go kill them all, but Lambor's worried. She thinks it might be a trap. Did you find out anything? That's awful. I'll go find the captain. Get back to the fortress and let Lambor know. Maybe it's not too late. You're back. Good. Do you know what this cult is planning? Bloodthorn cultists were sighted at those ruins. 
Chieftain Tazgul has already taken the army to deal with them. They're walking into a trap. Chief Tazgul is leading the orcs toward Karzogs. He's determined to wipe the Bloodthorn cult off Betnik. <laughs>